Welcome back everybody, my name is Nick930 and this is a summary of gaming news this week. If you head over to the Humble Bundle website right now, you can pick up Telltale's The Walking Dead Season 1 absolutely free, no strings attached. There's also some pretty good deals on the other seasons for this game, so if you're looking to play this series, now's the perfect chance. We got to see some extended gameplay this week of the new THQ action RPG Bio Mutant. be sure to check that out. NAC 2 released this week on the PS4 and is available for $40. It's received mixed reviews so far, with most critics saying that it's better than the first game, but still nothing special. I'll be getting Mac 2 sometime this weekend, and we'll try to have a review sometime next week, so stay tuned for that. Destiny 2 also released this week on consoles for $60, and is receiving decent overall reviews. If you enjoyed the first Destiny, then you'll likely love the sequel. If you'd like to see how the sequel plays, I've posted some gameplay footage of the first couple missions, and I'll have a review ready for Tuesday. Battlefield 1 received the new Russian DLC this week, and if you'd like to learn more about it, be sure to check out my DLC review for In the Name of the Tsar. Rainbow Six Siege also received a big update this week, and again, I posted a video review on my channel that covers all the details. Player Unknown's Battlegrounds is receiving an update next week that will introduce foggy weather and a new weapon along with a few minor bug fixes. And that's it for gaming news this week. Thank you all for watching, and if you enjoyed this video and want to see more from me, be sure to like and subscribe for gaming news every week.